I'm Kyo from Japan. Thank you for your watching my YouTube channel. Today, I enjoy tempura. Do you know tempura? Tempura is a dish of deep frying, your favorite ingredient. I really like it. Okay, let's enjoy cooking. First, I will introduce the ingredients that I will use today. Sweet potato, carrot, pumpkin, king oyster mushroom eringi, shiso, and chicken. Four tempura butter are flour, egg, and water. If you have sparkling water, use it instead of water. Can be used to make tempura crispier. I cut the ingredients. Today, I will make only it for myself, so I will cut only a few ingredients. Slice the sweet potato diagonally. Suck them in water for 10 minutes to remove the rye. Next is pumpkin. Slice the pumpkin thinly. One slice is enough today. Next is carrot. Cut carrot into round slice. Next is eringi, a kind of mushroom. Cut off the indivo bottom part and then slice vertically. You can freeze the eringi mushroom that you don't use today. I will only use the one slice today. Next is shiso, a type of herb. Without cutting the shiso leaves, beat them strongly with both hands. Last is chicken. Slice the chicken diagonally using the sogigiri method. I love chicken, so I would like to eat two pieces today. Season the chicken in advance. Garlic, ginger, soy sauce, cooking sake. Mix and apply to the chicken. Adding sake makes the meat tender. Make tempura butter. Mix 30 gram flour, 15 eggs, and 40 ml of water. If you have sparkling water, I recommend using it instead of water. Because you can make tempura more crispy by using sparkling water. When mixing, it is important not to mixing completely so that the flour remains. Warm up the oil, first heat it at about 160 degrees Celsius. Fried vegetables expect mushroom. Coat carrot and dive into oil. Pumpkin also dive. Sweet potato dive vigorously. When the butter becomes crispy, take it out of the oil. The upper
ポルキシメタイプフォークライン is listed in the overview column at the end of the vegetable put the shiso in the oil it will be fried in tens of seconds place on the grid to remove excess oil Then heat the oil to 118 degrees Celsius. Fry mushroom and meat. Just like vegetable, when the outside become crispy, take it out. Of my favorite species of chicken. <laughs> Place the tempura on a plate. In Japanese food, presentation is very important. Arrange it carefully so that it looks neat. Place the shiso on top. The delicious temper is ready. How is it? It looks very yummy. In order to enjoy eating tempura, set up the table. This is perfect tempura dish. Itadakimasu is an important greeting that Japanese people say before eating. First, shiso. Listen! It's crispy! Very delicious! It's so good! Next, I will eat my favorite meat. Add a little salt. Crispy on the outside and juicy on the inside. Eat the best tempura. I'm so happy. It was so delicious that I finished eating it in two bites. Shabba it slowly in my mouth. Next is mushroom in one bite. The fragrance and taste of mushroom spread in my mouth. This is also good. Next, carrot in one bite. Sweet and yummy. Even carrots, which I don't like, can be eaten deliciously by making them into tempura. Making tempura looks difficult, but once you try it, it's easy. Today, I made tempura with my favorite ingredient. You can also make it with your favorite. Vegetables and seafood, such as eggplant, corn, fish, and shrimp, and blah blah. I'm sure you will love it too. Pumpkin is also good taste. Next is sweet potato. 
it's so sweet. Last meat. It's a pity to eat it. I ate it. The print is empty. I want to eat more. I will end it with tea. It was very happy meal. Thank you for your viewing. How was tempura? Do you want to eat tempura? If you enjoyed this video, please check my YouTube channel and tap good mode. And please send your comments. Thank you so much. See you next week. Bye.